So welcome back my friends to another Fallout 4 video and today I'm going to be going over what is potentially one of the most useful weapons that you can find in Fallout 4 or at least weapon prefixes that you can find uh, within Fallout 4. Now we do want to give quick credit to French Tomahawk. I would not have known about this if it wasn't for him or at least known how effective this actually is uh, without him so you can check him out down in the description down below and let's get straight into this. So the weapon we are going to be taking a look at here today is the Nikappa Auto Pipe Rifle and damage is not what you're looking for here. What you are looking for though is the legendary prefix that in my opinion is really really powerful and are one of the most useful legendary prefixes in the game which is Nikappa which provides 20% chance to cripple the target's leg. Now to put this into perspective, when you have this on a weapon which is pretty much auto and that has a really good fire rate, this by the way is entirely based around fire rate. The faster fire rate your weapon has, you know, the better this actually will be. But just to put into perspective how good this is, you will pretty much immobilize any enemy within seconds when using this weapon, rendering them crippled. So we're talking death claws, Myla, queens, super mutants, anything in the game is going to get crippled when using this weapon very, very quickly. You can see here when on very hard difficulty we do end up spawning in like seven death claws which literally last a few seconds when using this weapon and once again it's not really based on damage this weapon is used to cripple your enemies and then finish them off with a different weapon so once you've crippled an enemy uh, within seconds of using this weapon you can then switch to a different weapon and finish them off that way you can see in the video the weapon I do end up switching to uh, is an explosive damage shotgun once again probably being one of the most sought after uh, legendary weapons in the game you can see in the background how much damage damage this explosive shotgun uh, actually does here but in general the kneecapper legendary prefix really is one of the most useful ones you can have especially on those harder difficulties and it's something that I personally overlook completely when I'm going through my first two playthroughs on the game so how do you get a weapon like this or how do you get the kneecapper on certain weapons and this of course is through legendary enemies once again this isn't really specified to one weapon I, in my opinion once again uh, it is better on the auto pipe rifle just for effectiveness once again we're not looking for damage here you know for the fire rate for the ammo type and just in general uh, pipe you know weapons in the game are a lot easier to get from legendary enemies than other weapons in the game but once again it's from legendary enemies so you can either farm for legendary enemies in fact I have done a top five legendary farming spots uh, in the game in a video compilation if you guys do want to check that out uh, that will be linked down in the description down below or you can just play for the game normally and hope you get this dropped from a legendary enemy so this is just one of those videos that I guess is the purpose behind this is just to say do not overlook the kneecapper legendary prefix and who knows maybe you've overlooked it already maybe you already have some one of these in your inventory or stored somewhere uh, that you can go back and check out just to see if you do have a weapon similar to this but anyway that pretty much wraps it up for this video today if you guys did enjoy or did find it helpful be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below Subscribe if you guys are new around. We do top fives, top tens on Fallout Rare weapons, armor, and many more that I'm sure you guys will enjoy if you do enjoy Fallout 4. But anyway, once again, hope you enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys next time with a brand new video. Peace out.